Patrona. Du. Northern Quebec. Carl Fulbert sought information for a living. That is to say that ever since he returned from Korea, after having served with the armed forces, he had been working as a private investigator in Montreal. I see. Just so he can drive for hours on rough roads. Oh, careful, that could but start a fire. But that's it always been. Okay. They had set up to meet at the general store. Oh. Whee! I'm definitely speeding. It was customary around these parts to close them off. Oh, no. But it was also customary to ignore those signs entirely and drive there anyway. I see. Should I leave it running? I, I feel like I shouldn't leave it running. What? What is this dot? How do I inspect? E? How often does a road need to be closed to require two picnic tables at this gate? Don't know. Hey guys, that's a bit creepy. Guess someone's into wrestling. Uh. Where am I? Go back up. There we go. Flipping egg. Ooh. Thank you. Fire starter. Not gonna take the uh, general tools, okay? We. Ooh, can I jump? Yeah, blimey! Careful now. Hello. For another day, Carl had waited long enough for someone to come and raise him. Still okay. not a soul in sight. There was no point in waiting. I'm not anymore. waiting any longer. Carl had to figure this one out by himself. Yeah, I've done it. Hamilton is waiting for Carl in the general store. It was time for him to get down to business. He pronounced general store as if it's a store where you buy generals, and rather than a store of general items. Come on now. It's pretty flippin' Ooh, bad to- Hamilton oh. enjoyed a lavish Sorry. country house built in the very heart of the northern forest. Not too far from here. Lovely. It's pretty bad to just come along and- Jesus. Price. Come on now. There we go, just about. Yeah, but like I'm trying to say, it's pretty bad to come along and just break their chain. I'm gonna have to buy a new one now. Let's see if I can get up. No, it doesn't like it. Fair enough. Okay, I've 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 fudged this now, haven't I? There we go. There we go. Uh, one more. Five points earned. Lovely. Enough, Carl thought. The target would become the man himself. Yeah, maybe. Whoa, flip an egg! Oh, just fabulous. Where is that guy even going? The road's blocked. Is that it? Is it over? Alright. Oh, okay. Carl needed to get out of there. The cold and the pain required urgent care. Is the other guy dead? Connor! Uh, yeah, I'm not going that way. I'm gonna go check on the other dude. Lay chains. Why is this door... There we go. It was a small, locked box engraved with the letters W.H. William Carl thought about taking it. Holden. It was to be left a chance. Yeah, pick up this as well. Come on. What? Come on now. Pick it up. Pick it up, buddy. Why? <laughs> Fine. Isabel photo. Lovely. This looks pretty dangerous. South Atamipec. Atamipec. E. Does that make it warm? Or. I don't know. Start fire. I have wood starters. Oh, I just need actual wood. Uh. 
Uh, hello? Can anyone get me some wood? Am I dying? Am I just gonna Cold fail? Turned into pain. I'll be alright. Carl needed to find someplace warm. I'm working on it. There's nothing up here. Fan bloody turn stick. Is there wood in the boat? No. Where do I get wood? Oh jeez. Are you kidding me? One log. Come on. Ugh. Lovely. We're fine now. So this looks dangerous. Close the door. I'm gonna double check up there. Maybe I can do something with the flag. No. Great. Can't even see anything from up here either. Oh. Chain. Even better than he had hoped. Carl Fulbert had succeeded once more. Yeah. And was now on his way to new adventures. Can get back in the car. Which, given that this is the 70s, probably isn't that much warmer than being outside. Yep. Chains on one wheel. I will be sorted. See if I can put stuff in the Chevy. Ooh. I assume there's wood in there now. Carl is in bad shape. He to heal his wounds and warm up before going any further. I was warm. Should I not just spend some time here like a whole day? Oh, I've got a flashlight. Matches, Polaroid, fire starter, pincer. How do I heal? Cigarettes? That's not going to heal me, right? Let's give it a go though, maybe. Carl, like many of his contemporaries, oh, no. felt like he had more trouble okay, breathing it's hurting than me. Was... I mean, it says rations right here, but I'm... Okay. Hello? Pennywise? Let's just keep going this way then, I guess. No? Then what do you want me to do? There's something up here that I'm missing? Flippin' boot. Oh, of course. Is there a quick way to just access that? No? Tab? Tab is also flashlight. Okay. Nice one. Nice. Nice and smooth. It's almost as if you didn't crash your car. Ah, I just continue to town. Everything will be fine. Though I can't see a bloody thing. Can I turn on my headlights? The metal winding industry. Hello. We are slowing down and reversing. I saw an off shot and we're taking it. Okay, the game is not sure about that. Whoa! That's the game's fault. Another crash car, I think. Why are you driving so fast, Carl? Carl's military training had made him a very punctual man. Being late to his meeting with Hamilton was out of the question. Fine, you're probably late anyway because you crashed your car and were there for hours. Why are you driving like this? I... Ah! Good thing that the general store was close by. It best be because I, I've just been going the complete wrong way. And the game's thinking about it again. It's an achievement that I made it here. Absolute achievement. The general store. Nice. You're probably running on fumes because you always bloody leave it running. The pumps wouldn't surrender their divine nectar. So In all likelihood, they had to be switched on from inside the store. Why are they not switched on? What's in the cooler? The milkman had to drive by every week to fill the bottle. The fresh milk indicated a recent visit. Yes. Jesus Christ! Carl had no trouble recognizing his employer. He had been killed. There was no need to be a detective to figure that out. That didn't give but me any stress. The detective could have noticed that the killer had to have been very close. That the fatal blow had been given before the victim even realized. <gasps> it was the milkman. We worked that out because the milk was freshly delivered. Right. Can we... Oh, and then... Yeah, 
Nice. Yeah, keep that. If Hamilton was dead, then who was going to pay him? <laughs> yeah. What what happened? Why did I I clicked inspect and then Oh the place isn't it came up there. That's lovely. Uh, no, no. Oh, flip it. An explosion suddenly occurred outside. I can open all of them. Just some dust. Lovely. Some more dust. Ooh, tape. I'll be taking that. <gasps> the ledger. Yeah, rob the man. What? What are we doing? A. Three. Credit sale. Okay, fair enough. That's fine. You know what, Hamilton? I have a frog in my throat. <laughs> and when people have a frog in their throat, they do not need to take risks by going to work. <laughs> Customers could catch it, right? Oh, I'm a wise man, not to worry. I'll have a nice doctor's note, which I'm going out to get right now. Sadly, in the meantime, I will have to close down the shop. Unless you would like to come in, fill in for me. Wouldn't dare advise you. After all, you must know how it's done, since it's yours now. With regards, your dedicated manager, Giles, with two L's. And the door fit on one page, but I can still scroll. Nice. Hey, dogs. Maintaining his composure, Carl recalled something from his military training. Wolves always stay away from populated areas. Wait, was it about bears? Uh, I think it's both. Pretty sure it's both. Well, this is the generator, isn't it? Not just. Eh. Carl was no electrician, but he could identify a wiring problem when he saw one. Okay, what? I need Carl was no electrician. Yeah. But he could identify Great. a wiring problem when he saw one. Something randomly chewed through the flipping wire for no reason. Alright. See the problem here is you got a lump of wood on your car. To make that lift budge. The poor thing was out of power. Yeah. This narrator sounds really familiar. It's stupid. I think he narrated an audiobook that I listened to recently. Maybe. Or maybe they just both have a very warm, cozy voice. Come on now. I'll look through the bin. Boom! <coughs> Lovely. Whoa, it moved. As if an iceberg came out of the ground? That was a first. Probably a giant hailstone, right? Whoa, what a... what? Yes, I'm gonna keep that, but what's up with the weird marks on the... It looks like... Devil horns. Prince? Carl found a surprise at every turn. Was the camera faulty, or was it a possible lead? Follow the doggy paws. At a later date, I need to go look through the inside again. Hey! So open the cash register. Nice, easy. Punch the price. Two numbers minimum. Press sale. Turn the crank two times. Alright, let's give that a go. So we go. $12. Sale. Crank. Take the key. Can I have that money, please? No? Fine. Climb up. Where am I going? Okay, that was weird. Just take some sherry. Fine. You never know when you might be invited to a party. 